There's like an elite guy that says like a really big shield or something in their main base, if I remember correctly. Swim pretty quickly. I did like, I think, in the beta. What is this? Shell rock. Just a bunch of gravel. Oh, shellfish. Probably about half of this next major zone before I was like, okay, I don't want to go too hard before like it fully launches. So a couple of the areas I. Did slash semi remember like I, I kind of remember this area like I did do this area I don't remember exactly where the where all the shit is but I did do this area. in this like main base over here. There's the uh what's it called rift anchor. around and get it eventually. Where are, you, where are you going? Come back. I remember the AI in this zone being particularly bad. It seems like not as bad now. I mean, it seems, you know, basic, obviously, but, like, it was, like, really stupid before. It would, like, sit there and, like, you'd shoot at it and nobody would react or anything. Looks like they fixed it up a bit, which is a good thing. A very good thing. <laughs> so Jesus just walk up to someone and attack and smack him. Hello. Is this the elite guy? See, I sound like a soldier in uh, fear. Cases we need, yeah, we need access card though. Somewhere around here, William Crystals. Forgot exactly where it is. Somewhere around here, I'm sure we'll find it. Who's there? Did you hear that? 
Det är okej. Okay. That sounds so good, what the fuck? Needs guns. Oh shit, the sniper aiming at me. Ow. Even here. Do I know what endgame is for this? Uh, not really. Uh, all the bosses have like giga hard modes, like two extra hard modes at max level, so that. Uh, lead here by the helicopter. Uh, yeah, I'm coming. I, I, I don't know what the helicopter is. I'm going to find this cart. I see. So we thought we know where the mystical crate is. We just need the key. And wait, that guy was an elite. Or at least it didn't count for me. No, oh, wait, that is the elite. He just didn't count for some reason. I don't know. It's weird. Maybe you have to get the killing blow on it. The elite drops the key. Oh, did it? I, he didn't drop any loot for me, so I guess I'm just gonna have to wait for him to respawn. Once I can mooch this as well, looks like I can mooch it too. here as well. Ooh, got a document cart. How's about that? I gotta make nine. So we need all of these. Uh, what can we do? Wait, wait, what was that? Black fell What the fuck was that? Black fell something. So there's something with this half picture as well. This. Back for extraction permit. That's portable, portable fuel and assets, whatever. I mean, Nordy has like played this entire game. Uh, Garrus. There's another lead up here. So those are just for a bit of loot at refineries? No. We have a cart in three. It's way better than cart in two. Melee is OP. This key. Uh, where was this? Uh, over here.
pretty good to me. Pretty lined up to me. You have to be standing in a specific spot as well or something. So we have to exactly have to get these puzzles. Yeah, I don't remember it being so finicky. I, I did this one, I remember that's why I remember this like exactly where to generally go stand. There we go. I, honestly though my game crashed, that was very jarring. What do we still need? We need the rift anchor, which is very close by, and we need an elite. Things you find at military bases, gardening shears. I don't think that guy's a lead. But he deserves to die nonetheless. I remember it's like here well the guy we killed down there and here it might be the same guy just like patrols up and down so the respawn's not too bad now we fucking clean this place out though Ugh, okay there's a TP on the tower island I don't know if you got it uh, no, I didn't yet. I'll get it. I'll get it on the way out. Well, it sucks. So respawn time on this thing. And why didn't it count? I melee him for like 900 damage while Horny was shooting him. Classic wow tagging all over again. I imagine like 30 people here and they're gonna all tag only one at a time. Hopefully, not the case. Party event surge of fish. Can you teleport there? Hmm. Spawn, isn't it? In it, bruv. <laughs> go to bed, Teddy. I should probably go to bed soon. No reason I'm crushing it tonight. I can start streaming. Oh, I mean, I still want to kill this guy. I don't want to, like, leave here now, but. I'm coming to chop you. Okay, at least because they're meant to be shambling idiots, but these guys are, these guys are well, basically shambling idiots. Oh man, the 
them spawn. Is it a reminder? Well, I was considering going like super duper late tonight, but I don't think that's like a big reason to, ultimately. Or in the sleep schedule. I think this guy just spawned in. Like it's the usual, do we go to bed at 6 a.m. and start streaming at 5 p.m.? Or do we just, oh, it's a propeller, nice. Or, you know, do we not do that and start streaming at a proper hour tomorrow? I think it's better that way, too, because it's not great for you. For me to start streaming and use like going to bed, it's not fair. Also for, you know, health purposes. But that's not here, there, or there. These guys aren't elite. Thank you for sitting there and not shooting me. Back, so it shouldn't be too long before the elite spawns. Try to loot some shit in the meantime. Yeah, it's actually dog shit. Ah, oh, it's terrible here. It, it, it felt like it like improved a bit from what I remember um, in beta because it was really like pretty shit then. But it seems like only the first couple mobs that we lucked out with, and now they're just shit. So they obviously didn't really do much work. I guess that was fine for the monsters to be like that to a certain extent because. The monsters have erratic movements or they're zombie style, like like the, the human AI in this. Some of these guys must have just spawned. Yeah. Human AI in this is, is pretty dog tier. Bro, this knife is just so much better than dealing with a gun right now. Granted, it's a tier two and the other ones are tier one, so that would change. Okay, I'm just gonna wait for this guy to spawn. Should be soon. Like bugged out because I melee him. Nah, I think it's just this morning. Like tagged him. That's what it is. Dashed it and shoot him in the arm, I guess. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Alrighty. Alright, uh, let's grab this real quick. Not the best display of artificial intelligence. Bro, really? Bro, ain't no way, man. Yeah, 
fuck you video game, not dismounting. Hope the AI becomes better later on. Like I said, the monsters have been fine, right? So if all the encounters are like monster bosses and things like that for like bosses, it's fine. I don't expect the human AI is going to get smarter all of a sudden. It doesn't seem like it's a difficulty thing. It just seems like it's just like shittily done. NGL. Monsters have been fine though. everywhere tomorrow. I'm going to go cash this thing in first. That's good. Boss is the most important. Yeah, I, the outdoor content in this game is definitely like... The fuck you? Get off my lawn! Go on, get! Um, definitely tailored more towards like survival crafting exploration than this combat. I doing? All right. All right cash this. Well, at least that's certainly more strong suit. Put it that way. Glad you brought this up. I just have another She's job. She's a ventriloquist. Feel up to it. Believe me, I could tell you plenty about Rosetta. But how about you do me a favor first, huh? Your former comrades in the Mayflies may have left something behind that I could use. What's that? Where do I find it? I'm interested in Mayfly artifacts. One item in particular, but I'll take whatever you can find. There's always a market for that kind of thing. There's an industrial area near here, infested with deviants. The Mayflies were holed up there just before they launched their raid. I'm hoping they left behind some artifacts, maybe even the one my client is looking for. You bring me back whatever Mayfly artifacts you find, and I'll tell you what I can about Rosetta. Good luck out there. Weirdly enough, all the characters that have been voiced have been, like, fine. As far as their voice acting is concerned. Random, I don't know. Not that there's many voiced ones, but yeah. Uh, yeah, you can only port every 10 minutes. That makes sense, makes sense. See, that character is even more animated than she was. Red. So this is ass cat. Or like trash can. Uh, we've got a new buddy, didn't we? Mini feast or combat as well. <clears throat> Designate a target to attack with mini feaster. Targets in the direction you're facing uh, will be prioritized if there are no targets. How does it do, though? Designate a target. Touch of the ass. Continuously follows the player. Summons one tentacle near an enemy. <clears throat> Every five seconds, tentacles will smash and deal damage to enemies. When a target triggers bounce, one tentacle is guaranteed to spawn next to the target. Cooldown 1.5 seconds. Every one tentacle despawned will increase the player's weapon damage by 17.5% up to 70%. What the fuck? This thing's insane. Holy shit. Uh, yeah, we're taking this. That's for sure. Later, butterfly. He's got a cute little eyeball and stuff. I guess cracked. Oh, damn. Still so, so don't really understand what designated target does, but whatever. Fuck it, brother. Uh, 
couple blueprints, apparently. Right, we have the MP5. Which is meh. I'm not really that interested personally. The Cam Pioneer. Could be good. I think this is what Orny was using. I'm fine with the pistol and the shotgun, though. Shrapnel damage, 30% chance to drill shrapnel with a hit. What's going on? Why can't I? Oh, we already have it. Okay. Light machine gun icebreaker. Light machine gun in TFD was really good under hose here. First hit after reloading trigger was frost vortex. Oh, see, like this would be good with the little ice guy that we just got, but I don't know if I want to be using that one. Three eleven torch. What what is the three eleven based on? Because the damage output's way lower. Weird. Weird. All right. The exploration record is the max here, Claret. But didn't we just do that? I guess we can do that tomorrow. It does lose a bit of water over time. Cool. Um, all right, Chad. Let's 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 break it here, and we will continue this. All day tomorrow. I'm right here. I didn't see any threats at night. They were saying there was like immediate threats at night as well. I think I've seen a single like home invasion while I've been crafting and stuff. Maybe it's a later thing or something. I don't know. Um, but yeah, either way, I'm enjoying the game a lot for sure. It's, it's, it's a lot of fun. I mean, it's just a lot of fun grindy stuff, you know. Uh, the questing is definitely a little dull, right? I mean, it's 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 literally go to a zone, collect the three chests, trigger the thing. So that's not exactly the most exciting shit in the world. But the combat's, like, fun enough, and the survival crafting's keeping me distracted enough that that's not become too much of a monotonous chore yet. Though, frankly, for a free-to-play game, I suspect that it's just going to be copy past the, the whole way through. Going to go to a zone, do a bunch of POIs, get their chests, do the zone boss, go to the next zone, rinse, repeat, you know? Um, but the, the survival crafter is, is pretty damn fun. And it's pretty high quality of life compared to some other ones that have come out. Even just the small things like depositing and deposit all, sorting, all that kind of shit, which you, like, you think is like basic, but a lot of games don't do. Gian Eleanor, who's probably already gone to bed. Um, anyways, alrighty. I'm out, chat. I'll see you guys tomorrow. 1 p.m. I'm sorry about being really late today. I just had a really rough morning, but hopefully that won't happen again because it's like about to have a mental breakdown this morning. Um, and we'll pick it up from right here.